Hello folks, welcome to another episode at IB uh, Electronics World and today we are going to talk about uh, digital electronics uh, we are going to start explaining uh, the Boolean algebra and truth tables and you don't need to have any background uh, you don't need to be to have an advanced knowledge uh, on the digital electronics we are going to start step by step with the basics some logic gates and explanation uh, about the truth tables so the first logic gate we are going to talk about today is the gate logic gate and so I will mention only two inputs and one output so the symbol looks like that sorry my drawing are not the best but I'll try to explain as simple as I, as I can simple as I can and then so this is the symbol we have two inputs A and B and we have one output which the the C and now we are going to illustrate the truth table A B and C so we have 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1. And then we have 0, 0, 0, 1. And that's because it's like a multiplication. So you have 0 multiplied by 1, it's equal to 1. And 0 to 1, it's... Uh, uh, 0 and then 1 to 0 is 0 and then 1 to 1 is 1 and the boolean, ex boolean expression it will be like this a multiplied by b the second logic gate it will be the or again I'm not going to explain more than uh, with more than two inputs because there is no point. You, if you if you got it with two inputs, you can find out what it will be with three or four. But if you are not, please leave me some comments and I will try to explain more. So this logic gate is or similar to that, but you can see that it does have a vertical line. As the end, it has like an arrow. So again, the truth table for that A, B, and C. So you have zero, zero. It's very easy. So you can do zero, two zeros, one, one, and then one, zero, one. And the output for that is zero, one, one, one. And the Boolean expression it will be A plus B. And it's like add the one input into the other. So practically you have zero input to A and B input equal to zero. So it gives you the zero and so on. And so on. Uh, the next very simple logic gate is the inverter, which we are calling as a knot. So it has a triangle with a circle at the end here. So A is the input and B is the output. So if you have 0, the output is 1. And if you have 1 input, the output is 0. And more advanced logic. Actually, yeah, the, the Boolean expression, I forgot to mention, the Boolean expression for that is, let's say, f equal to uh, not a, or a with an inverter. So that means it's exactly, this is not a. I will continue with a, a, an, another gate, which is the NAND. 
So actually it's and exactly the same as the and the first gate we learned plus one cycle. Again, you have two inputs, A and B. So you will understand that it's really easy. So the result for that, it will be in the truth table. If you, if you make the truth table, it's 0, 0, 1, 1, and then 0, 1, 0, 1. So it's 1, 1, 1, 0. And that's why. I will explain why. So practically it's an AND gate with an inverter. And you have the NAND gate. And the Boolean expression for that it will be C equal to A multiply with B, so it's multiplication, plus the inversion symbol. And in addition, we have the um, NOR gate, which is OR gate with the inver inverter, the node. That means that exactly the same logic as the AND. AND the OR plus an inverter. So in the previous case, we had a, B, C, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 0, 1. And it's very easy, actually, you can, if you have a third variant, let's say C, three inputs, you can say four zeros and four ones, and to the left here. So you can add four zeros and one, and then you, you need to repeat all this. So two zeros, two ones, and, and etc. So in that case, because we have, if it's only OR, we have 0 and 0 equal to 0, but we have invert, it will be 1, and all the rest will be 0, because in the previous case, the OR, the first one was 0, and because and the rest was 1, but now we have the inverter, and it will be uh, the other way, vice versa. And the algebraic, the Boolean expression, it will be A plus B, it's exactly the same as uh, your gate, plus the inverter. And last but not least, it will be exclusive OR. So the exclusive OR, it's an OR gate, like this, with an extra R here, and we have again two inputs, A and B, and one out output again, exclusive XOR, and I would make again the truth table. So you have 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 0, 1, and then the output for that would be 0, 1, 1, 0. So you have, in both cases, you have doubles. So once and one, you have 0, and 0, 0, you have again 0. And the Boolean expression for that, it will be A plus cycle B. I hope you enjoyed this video. This is uh, again a basic Boolean algebra and truth table. Uh, if you like this video, please uh, like this video, subscribe, and write me on the comments uh, what would you like to, to do next.